You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Item provided by ChocoCurve.com for review. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. Excited to check out a subscription box from Choco Curve. And thanks to them for sending me this box to check out on video. What's different about this box from the last box is this one is the mini version. So pricing is different. So I'll leave that information in the description. Plus a link to them. You can check that out. And I do want to let you know they also, well, just so you get an idea of size, also send the box with a freezer pack, which keeps it nice and chilled on its travels. Now, I have not looked inside, but it's time. I see what kind of chocolate I get to test out this time. And then we'll know how many bars each pack. A little information here. It says, discover extraordinary chocolate. Thank you for being a Choco Curb member. We're incredibly excited for you. Well, thank you. Incredibly excited for you. And there's all the social media, which I'll probably tweet on or mention. Okay, let's just see if we can save this. Almost. Almost saved it. Here's my little card. Just some information from them. Discover extraordinary chocolate. And then let's just lay out the actual bars. So... Being a smaller box, you get a smaller sampling than the last box, and you get a decal. Looks like a decal. I think it was the last time, too. So the three bars are this Manoa chocolate from Hawaii breakfast bar, this lemon organic fair trade lemon 45% milk chocolate bar, limited edition spring collection from Theo. We've had some of their stuff before, and this dolphin the Art of Blending Chocolate au Light. New Sweats. Oh, whatever. Let's just try the small bar first. All right, let's look at the packaging. It's from Belgium. Okay. And the rest of the information I really can't read. But I can surely look at it. Milk chocolate with hazelnuts. That I can read. Let me get my cutting board out here. I want to make sure I get these on the board nice and displayed. Now these are fine chocolates, and we will see. I did not refrigerate them in any way. I pulled them right out of the packaging, and now I'm making the video, so here's what it looks like. Let's just break one. I see the hazelnut pieces on the back, see them in there? Let's give this a taste, hazelnut. Delicate. There's like little lines across the top. I don't know if you can see it. Mmm. Rich and creamy, and you get those little tidbit bites of the hazelnut, which are really small in there. So you get that little textural difference in that one. All right, very tasty. Let's do this next. I'm gonna leave the lemon one for last. Breakfast bar, 60% made in Hawaii, two ounces. Interesting packaging, a nice, almost like a cardboard package. Here's the ingredients. It's nice when the ingredients list is really small. Grass Shack Industries, from bean to bar. Let's see what that means. Ooh, look at that. Now it looks like it suffered a little damage coming to me, but ooh, look at that. Now it's all wrinkly and filled with stuff on the bottom. Let's see what that stuff is. Let's see if we can get it out without totally destroying it. I'm doing it this way because it doesn't have the neat, neatest texture. But I think at this point, I'll have to try to put it back together. We can rebuild. It's like the $6 million candy bar. But there is a lot of chunky pieces, so... This is what it looks like. I've put it back together, look. And now all those pieces, look at that, offers a lot of texture. It looks like actual beans that I'm gonna crunch right now. Here we go. Mmm, that's a good chocolate. And I do taste the beans. I like that one a lot. I'm a big fan of the actual bean, and that's what you get. Super tasty. All right, the last one. Let me move this out of the way. Mmm. Let me 
cutting that off is this bar here. Organic Fair Trade. Let's see where this one is from. From Seattle, Washington, the Theo Chocolate Incorporated. Our chocolate is so delicious because we care about quality and only source the finest organic and fair trade ingredients. This chocolate bar connects you with cocoa farmers around the world. Share it with someone you love, near or far. So that's why there's this two from. Celebrate spring with sweetly tart lemon in luscious 45% milk chocolate. Now I'm not too sure about lemon and chocolate. We'll look at this bar, let's see. It's got the Theo logo on it. Let's just crack it. Well, let's, let me do this so you can kind of see it in all of its pre character glory. And here we go. Lemon. I smell it. So you can smell the flavor of the lemon. It's got a nice thicker bite to it than the other candy bar, the first one. It's got a good density to it as you bite it. Super tasty. The lemon, yeah, I wasn't too keen on seeing, tasting lemon and chocolate, but it's okay. It's a very light, flavorful lemon. Very good. There's all three of the candy bars in the mini box. And they're all very good and tasty. And thanks again to Choco Curb for sending me this box. Like I said, I'll put all the link information in the description below so you have that. And as always, thanks for watching. If you want to see more subscription boxes, look in that link. We'll have a playlist there. Or you can always just go to LuckyPennyShop.com and search that as well. What's my favorite? I'm going to have to pick this one as my favorite, but I like that crunchiness of the beans on the bottom. Look how they're all just packed in there. Isn't that a neat looking candy bar? Or a chocolate bar? And thanks for watching. Later! If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave! What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh yeah, please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a Lucky Penny, pick it up. Thanks for watching.